You'll be fine. No. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. You have a boyfriend? Glenn. Glenn! I don't want that. It's not Christian. This nigga really was trying to get some cheeks you saw. You have a boyfriend? You didn't even know what she looked like. You just knew she had a, she was a woman from her voice. Glenn, you're off the team. You are not you are not survival ready, bro. Oh, can we take his jacket though? His jacket kind of swag. <sighs> Do we see Glenn? Did you see that? Sure did. So he's in there. Be ready to shoot. Guys. Oh man, I'm glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn. All right. Well, right then wasn't so hard. Right, we're ready to go Can back. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yeah. yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. You no, think I care? We gotta go now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas, and then up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked, and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her, and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I then, tried to convince her I wasn't, and that's why these guys came out. We of the might forest. not just, we might just not have to save her. And I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. Right. We can't just leave her. Uh, Damn right, we can. Okay. You guys are suicidal over a girl. I'm saving her, with or without you. You couldn't even save yourself, you. Glenn. Fine. Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. I would have left her ass, honestly. <laughs> Whose point of view is this? Am I a drone now? What the hell? Look at this dude. This dude's just chilling. Okay, this is the plan. We don't know how hard it's gonna be to get her out of that room. Yeah, it's boarded up. So we have to kill every one of them in here. Quietly, noise right. attacks these things. Carly, I respect it. But chill out. <laughs> okay, so we got one. Get down. So we got that one right there, close. Okay, so that way is clear. Go. I saw one lurking on the other side of that car. Okay. Uh. Can I just go right here? Slowly, 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 slow, slow, slow. Okay, good shit, Lee. Good shit, Lee. Glenn, get away from me. I don't need to talk to bitch ass uh, Glenn. Okay, um, I guess I do have to talk to bitch ass Glenn. We're a little naked out here, except for Carly's gun, and we can't use that much. Right. So I guess we can't go this way because they won't even let me go this way. I'm not sure I can take them both out myself, even if I had a weapon. Alright, then we're going back over here then. Glenn, follow me with your goofy ass. Alright, let's go this way and see what we got. Okay, so there's one right here. Okay, uh. I wonder if there's anything in the pickup. Well, let's look inside, shall we? Okay, a screwdriver. But if I smash it, it's gonna make a lot of noise, right? Fuck it. Ow. Damn it, hey, Lee! Man, that drew some attention. Be careful. I'm done trying to punch out windows. Bro, Lee, I didn't know you I didn't know you were a fucking bitch. You need to find a weapon. I found a why do you keep looking in here? I, I found a pretty damn good way to stop these guys quietly. Now we just have to get it quietly. Bro, I'm trying to there's three options here. Why do I keep going to the window? Bro, Lee, you're starting to piss me off now. Okay, so that was up. 
We're going right. I'm done trying to punch out window. This nigga Lee is pissing me off, bro. Am I gonna have to use my D-pad? We can do something with that car, I bet. If it weren't for that fellow lurking near the front. one by the car without attracting the others I need something to get into this car Lee I'm done trying to punch out window I'm why bro it's literally not giving me any other fucking options don't even don't even try it because you're gonna piss me off again Hello. Good luck smothering them to death. That's not really what I have in mind. What do you have in mind then, Lee? Are you gonna are you actually gonna put this pillow on this zombie face? Get out your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. What are y'all finna do? You are gonna sm Okay. That was sick. We put a silencer on that bitch. That was worth all the effort. Okay, new cover unlocked. What does this do? Oh, you wanna move this? That was kind of stupid, Lee. I'm not going to hold you. No. So we can't move this. It's not like anybody else is trying to help me, though. over there head upstairs and get out of here I'm already on it I wish I had more options I swear to God bro these damn door handles I can barely see anything take this damn spark plug stop looking around and reaching to take it it's yours now put this bitch in neutral so we can push it off the ramp. Spark, Spark plug. You should hold on to that. Coming in. All right, now push this car. God damn, my wrist hurt. All right, now we got movable cover, or we're just gonna smash dude into the wall. It was awesome. <laughs> Okay, I know what to do next. Uh, that's not really what I wanted to do. Okay. <laughs> I guess we're back here. Wait. Wait. Let me see the spark plug. What do you have in Who's mind, Glenn? Inside these things turns car windows to tissue paper. I needed that, Glenn. I needed the full thing. <laughs> this girl better be worth it. She bet. Obviously, she's not a survival specialist. She's that in here crying like a little good. bitch. That's exactly what I was thinking. Okay, we're going back over here, and we're gonna take this one out easy. Since Glenn wanted to destroy my spark plug, even though I needed that for a car. Oh wait, did I do that wrong? Was I supposed to stay? 
I think I was supposed to stay back here and attack him. Here we go, here we go, Lee. They just playing with it like Play-Doh. They're not even... Okay, good kill. They're not even eating it. They're just playing with it. All right, next one. I did not whistle. I'll wait for him to get closer. Okay, that's what you wanted to do. Next time, let me know. Bro, headshots only, Lee. Don't waste your time going for the chest. Carly, you got Birkenstocks on? And you still doing all this damage? Take this axe and cut his head open. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> Did he just swap my hand away? Don't do that. Don't swap my hand away. Take that screwdriver Dude, back. where'd your weapon go? Into that ice big sized hole. <laughs> Holy shit. It's cool. Now we've got this. No, we what need both. Bro, where'd your weapon go? You've been behind me this entire time. That should help. Alright, up the steps we go. It took a long time, but we're finally here. Why don't you guys lag behind just in case this goes to hell? Okay, we'll be right behind you. Carly, you have a gun. You shouldn't be... It should be me, then Carly, then Glenn. That's the formation we should be going in. Alright, first swing. Here we go, here we go. Uh, hello? 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 Give me the action command! Thank you! That was taking a little too long. There we go. Swear oh, okay! Rad. Bro, kick his head off just in case. Where did their bodies go? Glenn, you couldn't deal with this single 2x4 We're talking about it's boarded up heavy. Bro, just take this hoe off. Hello in there. We're here to help. Please just go away. Let's go, guys. Right. In a no, minute. No means no, Glenn. If you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no, no. Please. She's in trouble. No. Miss, we're coming in. Bro, she does not want to be helped. Don't save her. If she don't want to be saved, don't save her. If she don't want to be saved, like... Stop! Just stop! I'm coming out. Oh, you're you're you're, hurt. you're pretty oh, much God. dead already. I said stay away. We need to get you help. She's it's too late. Yeah, she's she's pretty much Guys, dead. She's been bitten. What? I told you. I said go away. I'm bit. But you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. No. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and and you come back and you kill anything you can find. You have a boyfriend? Glenn. Glenn! I don't want that. It's not Christian. This nigga really was trying to get some cheeks you saw. You have a boyfriend? You didn't even know what she looked like. You just knew she had a, she was a woman from her voice. Glenn, you're off the team. You are not you are not survival ready, bro. Please. Just leave me. Please go. Okay. Okay, okay. bye. <laughs> we'll leave. Just try to take care of yourself for whatever time you have left. You have a gun. So? Can I borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? She wants to kill Give herself. It to me. I can just, you know, end this and then. I can then cut your head no off problem. right now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please. I don't want to be one of them. They're, they're satanic. I'll cut your head off. We're not wasting ammo. We can't let you do that to yourself. Then do it for me! We need to okay. get going. Give it to me, please! This is crazy! Please, Glenn, shut back. up! It's just two seconds, just one bullet, and I can be with my family, and it'll all be fine. Yes. Back up! Please! Oh, sh How weak oh, is this balcony? No! Oh my god! 
Carly, are you okay? Whoa, take it easy. We just want to help. You can't. Honestly, if she wanted to do it, Miss, you gotta she'll let us her. relax now. You need to think this through. We'll find you a doctor. It'll be okay. I just don't want her wasting our bullets. No, no! I mean, you know, it is what it is. I just wish she would have reimbursed us that damn bullet. That's why I was gonna just chop her head off if it gave me the option. Glenn. <laughs> you're not fit for this, bro. I'm I might have to kill you next. Let's get out of here. You have a boyfriend? Yes, Glenn. Bro. I forgot, and it attracts Here they come! Did Carly have a second gun, in, bro? <laughs> Did Carly have a gun right? and Glint? How yeah, did we get back we so fast? Calls, <laughs> what the hell? Glint is fine and... Well, yeah. We're okay. I've got a few cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. Look at how sad he is. Quiet. Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. I the could next care less. business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. Bro, I'm trying to smoke that Larry pack. I could care less if he dies or not. This fool came in too hostile. He's probably a little bit racist. Him and his daughter both can can go. How are we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? Uh, yeah. Let's, let's see if I can around. break okay. this lock off or something. Here we go. I hope you'll have another lock on standby. Awesome. Now to distract those things. Carefully. Okay, uh... Get the brick. That's what we needed, the brick. Doug, watch my back. Okay, I'll do it all myself. Uh, yeah. Go for the TVs, make that static sound even louder. Good shit. Can you turn up the volume on the TVs? Man, Now's the time. I'm not gonna lie, Duck, these are your people. These are... All y'all share about the same amount of brain cells. Be careful. Keep an eye out, will you? Lee, I'm sorry, but if I get the chance, I'm gonna have to kill your brother. It's, uh, you don't want to see your family like this. Hey, bud. I don't know what happened to mom and dad, but I know if you were there, you would have died for them. So, yeah. This fool don't know what you're talking so about. Did you find them yet? Give me a second. Got to do this now, man. Right, we, we got to do this. You can talk to him in your prayers. This isn't him anymore. Lee, you can look away. I'll do it for you. Close your eyes and give me control. That wasn't a good kill. You gotta go for the head. Exactly. Or you're gonna have to do it again. Get it right the first time so you don't have to do it again. And now you gotta do it again. And now you gotta do it again. And now you gotta do it again. Lee, can you aim for the head so you can stop mercilessly killing your brother? Thank you. You just stabbed your brother five times because you couldn't aim for the head. I hear the jinglings. There we go. All right, see you later, buddy. Holy crap! Right, stop Run. making a sound. Oh, look at that nigga! That nigga, like, bro. Did you drop the axe? And we don't have another lock. Damn it! You better barricade this door while I get the pills. Man, that was close. It still is closed. Did it. 
That's all that matters. Doug, you better watch your back. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Let's get off get my in. dick now. Can I have used the axe? Lee, what the hell? <clears throat> Lee, why was that even an option? That You just look stupid sometimes. Put this key in and stop being barbaric. What are we looking for? Nitro glistening? Oh, no. Oh, shit. We Damn it. Hurry. Lee, please tell me you know the code. What, what kind of cut was that? She got a screwdriver in her back. Look at that one. That one's just hanging out the car. Lee, do you know the code? I guess he doesn't. Oh, hell no. Doc, come on, baby. Time to go. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up right back. Do okay, Kitty. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly dallying. Man, fuck your dad. I'm gonna take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Where's Doug, Clementine? Curly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. Okay. Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Go ahead. I right, that door's not locked anymore. Shit. You three, get on it. Bro, I'll get the cane from the office and put it in the, the door of each. Away from the windows. Okay, I'll hold it here. If we don't make it through this, you should know that I think you're a great guy. Man, I don't give a fuck. Thanks, Doug. Doug, if we don't make it through this, you should know. What are you about to say to him? I should know what? Huh? You said I should know. Shit. Oh, oh, shit, buddy. Doug. Are you sure? Oh, shit. We don't have a choice. Oh. Doug, you better duck your head. Can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? Bro, okay. get the cane, Clem. Damn! Clementine, did you find anything? Nothing! Oh, see, Clementine's smart, she know! Look at Lee being a one-man army! One-man army! B! I found something! Good shit, Clem! Thank you! Lee, stick it through! R.P. Daddy! <laughs> Doug! Doug, I'm sorry, but I need the survival specialist more than I need you. Oh, but he's a hacker, but how, how good is that gonna come in handy? Uh, 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 take this! I thought that shit was about to be a chocolate bar. <laughs> no, get him off of me. Carly, you can sh Oh, never mind. Doug, you're wearing Birkenstocks. You weren't fit to survive anyway. Oh my god. Let's go! Okay, Kenny, let's go. <laughs> I made the choice and I don't regret it. Damn, Clem! Step on this bitch! What? I literally saved you! What do you mean? Oh, I'm killing him! Good shit, Kitty! Okay! Let's go! Bro, Larry, what is going on with you? Close this door! Larry, I'm coming after you crazy! He said, not today! What do you mean? Ooh, Larry, I'm about to, ooh, I'm about to body you. I'm about to push you off a balcony. Look at Clementine, disgusting. I thought that fool was moving like a worm. 
What's your name, Linda? Linda, what the fuck is wrong with your dad? Duck, stay away from Clementine. Your stupid might rub off on her. Please shut up. We don't want them hearing and getting the wrong idea. Where is what's what's his name, Larry? Oh shit, we gotta get out of Atlanta. I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in Oh, we're city. not in Atlanta. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Glenn, you're gonna die. We're never gonna see you again. The fuck you looking at, bitch? Oh, wrinkly face. Like, stop looking at me. And stop making that stank face. You gotta you do what you gotta do, bro. Gotta do. I can't gotta stop do you. This. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. He is still thinking about this girl who had a boyfriend. Glenn, you're not like that. All right, Glenn, it's been real. I respect your courage. There goes the Asian diversity in this game. We're not seeing him ever again. Larry, I see you back there. I don't want to talk to anybody right now except for Larry. Hey, kid. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have real to G. take care of each other. Facts. Yeah, we do. You said you wanted kids once. Uh, did I? I did, yeah. <laughs> Did I? Well, she's not your daughter, so you can't treat her like she is. Yeah, I know that. But you can take care of her. Hell, maybe better than a father even could. Facts, Thanks, Kenny. I got your back, pal. Kenny, a real one, bro. Duck, what are you talking about? What is this fool talking about? Larry, where are you? We got issues. Okay, I guess I gotta talk to Carly. Sorry about Doug, but, you know... How you I, doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I no. don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know, it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. Aw. I'm sure he yeah, liked I'm you, too. I'm sure he liked you, too. <laughs> you better have. Anyway... I'd rather be alone, I think. Fair enough. Look I'm at Clementine. Mistaken. She is sick of that man in the bag. Wait, Lee? Yes. What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. You're better at survival. I was going to help you both. But you helped me first. Yep. Yeah, I did. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. Duck is talking her, her ear off. Jesus Christ. Lair okay, I still gotta talk to everybody. <laughs> Duck is going on and on. I see you. I thought Super Dinosaur was toast. But you know what? He wasn't. They talking about Jurassic Park? Hey, Duck, uh, you wanna cool it for a minute? Right. Okay, sorry. Relax. I'm sorry, there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's... I got grabbed again. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. Glenn took our walkie! Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. I, I just realized that! Tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. Aww. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. 
I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. Hmm. Let me go deal with this. Bro, oh, I man. literally... Clementine, another thing. And here he goes, Doug, hey, shut up! You like my daughter? What? No! What do you mean? Good. Stay away from her. Or everyone here knows that Lee Everett is a killer. And I'm not talking about those things out there. You hear me? Bro said, you like my daughter? No, I don't like either of you, honestly. What are you talking about? You got feelings for my daughter? No. If I could, I'd kill I you both. You a question, boy. Watch you call boy. Then again, I wouldn't expect a convicted murderer to listen to anything anybody's got to say. Bro, break this dude nose. I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Bro, shut up. Your breast stink. I don't... Ooh. Carla, let hey, me see the gun real Lee? quick. Do you have a second? What do you want? What, what's her name? Linda? My it's dad would be Larry and Linda. For you. Facts. That guy Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I know. I don't know. We're lucky to have you. What is that sound? Why is it picking up? I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. We can use Larry hanging from a home. string of decoration yeah, on the you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. The famous last words before it's not okay. <laughs> and there goes the light. Is that the end of episode one? To be continued. Okay, this game is fine. Oh, next time, don't want spoilers. Take this off of me. Cover my eyes. Okay, let's look at the stats. Uh, honesty. Lied to Herschel. You and 63% were honest. Who's Herschel again? Oh, that's the dude from the barn. Uh, yeah, sure. Who would you say? Duck or Sean? You and 49% of players chose Duck. Okay, so pretty half on that. Side with Kenny. You and 48% of... Defended Kenny. Of course, Kenny's my guy. Give uh, Irene the gun. Okay, so the girl from the motel. You and 55 players refused. I honestly just didn't want her wasting our bullets or causing noise. I would have been perfectly fine with killing her with the axe because, you know, she was already bitten. But I did not want her wasting our supplies. Either way, she wasted our supplies and Drew Walker's near us. So, fuck her. Who would you save? Doug or Carly? You and 76% of the players chose Carly. Uh, yeah, I thought, I think she's just more useful overall, you know, Doug was pretty useful when it came to his tech knowledge, but I feel like tech isn't going to be a big thing in this game, you know, I feel like it's, you know, it's going out, even the lights already went out, you know, there's only so much tech it's going to do in the apocalypse after a certain point, but yeah, this was a fire episode one. But yes. First time playing Walking Dead Telltale. This will be the new series on the channel. Let me know what I should play after this. I'll probably just, I might just go into season two. Depending on how much I enjoy season one. It's fire. But Lee. He's a little crazy. I kind of I mess with him. He's on go like me. Lee is on go like me. Clementine. She's only eight. But she, she got the survival instincts. We just have to train her to stop falling. Lee also has to stop falling. He was falling a lot. Larry, if I get the chance, I'm blowing your brain off. I'm blowing your brain out, bro. <laughs> I'm blowing your brain out. Kenny is my guy. Duck is a little uh, slow. Kacha, she's probably cool. She's a cool little medic, maybe. Uh, Linda, honestly, I don't really know how I feel about you yet. You're kind of iffy. It's really your daddy. F worst comes to worst, I'm chopping your daddy's head off. Honestly, I'll probably do that on a good day. Oh, racist ass. And with that, I will see you in the next video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. We are on the road to 1,000 subscribers. I appreciate every last one of you for watching. Even you, all the way in the back, that supports what Glenn did being a simp. And with that being said, I will see you in the next episode. Peace.